To the left, right? Yep. I got it, and there's the boss. Here, Welcome to Retired Time Productions. We just got this in the uh, in the mail from Candela Research Center, and I know you've probably seen these test stands before. Some of the ones I've reviewed. This is actually the miniature version. This is for your micro and ultra micro uh, motor thrust uh, experiments. Like if you want to check props on a mini quad or maybe a small micro size airplane and uh, this will do the same job as the big ones but uh, much more conveniently and probably be more accurate since it is smaller for the smaller motors it's basically designed the same way as the big one and uh, I'll just show you the big one is behind there right now let's go take a look at it both of these are from Candela Research Center and you can see the difference in size between this uh, little one and the big one there and uh, I on my previous videos I uh, ran this one and checked some different props for larger size electric planes they also have a third size that is really big and you can do the big gas powered planes with it so this is the newest one they got in fact this is basically a prototype but it seems to be very well designed moves well and uh, to give you an idea how it works I'll just show you a little video clip from this one here where I check this with some larger motors. Okay, we're ready for the test of the 9x6. And we got the tack set to two blades now, which we messed up last time. Okay, here we go. I'm closing the door. We're in the control room. John's going to ramp it up. Three, two, one, launch! All right, hopefully that got it. So we'll be doing some testing like that with the uh, with the smaller one in the future and check that out and see how it works but it's very light uh, another thing I got is this this gram scale actually meant measures to a tenth of a gram and uh, I think I'll be using this for the for this smaller uh, scale because I don't need the great big scale with it and here it is right here you just take the cover off and it's got your normal modes tear or whatever measures to a tenth of a gram also we'll do pieces so if you want to measure pieces on the scale or quantity you can do that and then you can adjust this screw here to uh, level it get it going but it's a pretty nice scale just out of curiosity how much does this motor test stand weigh okay so here's what I got for weight on this test stand the actual test stand is being weighed. We got 172.3 grams for the miniature test stand. Now let's weigh the big one. Well that stand went into overload on this scale. The big one is just too heavy because the scale only weighs up to a thousand grams. So it went overboard on that. I'm using my sharper image scale that came from Bed Bath & Beyond to measure this uh, larger test stand here and it's measuring out at about 1.5 kilograms so those are the two motor thrust stands right there that you can get from Candela and like I say they have a third one that's even bigger and many other products on their website so let's just take a look at their website in closing so here's uh, Candela's uh, website right here and this is on the store tab and you can go down here and look at some of their products and they have lots of different parts at their store location which is in the Middle Lothian Turnpike uh, North Chesterfield Virginia uh, lots of RC stuff there but what they have on their website is actually a bunch of products that they manufacture um, I'm taking a look at this uh, aircraft wall storage system I'd kinda like to have that because that looks good for putting all your planes storing your planes on the wall you can put your wings and fuselages and here is the uh, park version of the test stand which I believe that's the first one I got and then they have the micro version right here which I just showed you and it comes uh, basically assembled and then there's a flat pack where you can assemble it yourself and there's plenty of other hardware and stuff like that that comes with it they show a picture this actually comes with it the extra mounts and screws and stuff like that so that's a basic idea of what's on their site, but also I want to mention that 
They do uh, laser cut materials for people, so if you have a design you want them to do, you can actually send them the idea and they will basically CAD the design and cut it out for you. So they also do that service too. So I just thought I'd mention that. And that's about it for this video. Uh, thanks for watching. And uh, maybe you'll get a test stand too and test a few motors. We'll talk to you later. Keep your light.